Well, Keith, obviously uh, disappointing uh, the scoreline there, particularly after a good first half. I know I seem to uh, take it to them in the first half, who uh, scored a nice try, a couple of penalties and stuff. Eh? Just didn't quite uh, deal with kick-off reception and uh, interception try, just bad luck and uh, just silly mistakes, just let them into the game. And uh, second half, we kind of fell asleep just after we came out, which has been a bit of a problem for us this season. So need to work on that for next week. You know, bitterly disappointed with the performance. Uh, we just had a bit of a, an honesty session there with the players before we before we came out and I think it's a lot down to the you know the build up that's happening next week. There's a lot of nerves involved in that and I think you don't know if people are worried about getting injured or you know or missing next week's game and there is pressure and there's twenty two guys on this field tonight and uh, you know there's only gonna be twenty next week so you know a lot of them I've made it fairly clear that there is you know places to play for. Uh, so I think all these things combined I think they're only human and it's it's been such a long time since Gala won that they are worried and they are nervous and I think they are uh, you know anticipating a massive game next week. So you know we just had to make sure we, we, we do the things that have got us to where we are now. So today's done and dusted. Obviously, we're looking uh, towards the next couple of games there. Had a big win against Glasgow Hawks uh, tonight. But you've got uh, Heriots at home next week. Absolute must win. I know. Uh, it's definitely still in our hands. So uh, we've got to take this game on board, uh, have a good training session next week. And uh, hopefully we can play like we did against Gala at Mansfield and really upward game up to that level again. And hopefully we'll do the job been 31 years since we won the league and you know I just I've just been saying to the players there is we need to grab it with both hands we need to take this opportunity because we don't know how many times this is going to come along who knows what's going to happen next season who knows what players are going to be here you know who, who knows what other teams are going to be strong so you know when the opportunity comes we have to grab it with both hands we don't let anybody take it away from us and you're right Melrose are vastly more experienced about winning titles they've done it you know twice in the last three years and then they've been in the Scottish Cup finals quite a few times so you know in terms of experience and that and how to make sure they cope with the nerves yeah they're a lot better than us but we're in a position we're in because we've been winning games and uh, you can't take that away from us and all we need to do is just make sure come that next, next Saturday control the nerves control the game do what we've done for the last year and uh, you know I'm sure we'll we'll get the result that we uh, that we need to get